lovies. What's going on? Welcome to my channel. This is Love Is Me, aka Brown Sugar Eighty One. Um, so happy Sunday, Monday, because it's after midnight, so therefore it is Monday. Um, wanted to come and show you guys my finger coils that I did. Um. The back ones are pretty nice, but I started to get tired and lazy towards the front, and, you know, it serves its purpose, it's wearable, it's, I think it's cute. What I did notice is that I, you know, I didn't curl, well, coil to the root. I did, but I didn't have enough clips to make them, like, stay, or whatever the case may be. So they are a little... Just coiled halfway. <laughs> um, the back ones are pretty good. They're coiled nicely. I think it's because I did them shorter that they look that way. But I just did a quick turnaround for y'all. Um, it took me a lot of hours to do this. That's why I'm like, I'm going to still wear them even though they're not perfect. But I'm still going to wear them because this was a lot of hard work putting this in. I was halfway done and I was like, oh, I'm going to wash them out. But I was like, nope, this took entirely too long. So the process that I used today was, um, well, I did my hair Saturday and it's Sunday night. So the process that I used, I did the Shea Moisture Purification Mask, dampened my hair, put some of this on it. After I rinsed it out, I put some Guardian Fruities, and I detangled with this one. I'm starting to like this. It's not better than a trust that made naturals to me, but I like this one also. If I can't get trust that made naturals, it would be the Guardian Fruities Pure Clean. Once I did that and detangled my hair, I followed up with the anti-breakage mask. Um, what is this? The Yucca and Bio Bob. I am almost out of the Yucca and Bio Bob, as you can see. Just have a little bit left. What I usually do is I mix honey and olive oil with this. Sitting on my hair, let it sit up there for like an hour. Hair be so nice and shiny and all that good stuff. It's like, I love, this is like my staple deep conditioner. Like, this is like the fourth container that I've bought. Like I really love this conditioner. I really love Shea Moisture anyway. You know, their products to me is very good. Um, after I did the deep conditioner, I was deciding whether to do mini twists or to do um, coils. Being that I took the time to do this, I think the next time I will do like some twist this size, like in my hair. Excuse me. Like the shrinkage was not as bad as I thought it would be, so I'll probably be able to do some twists this size in my hair. Um, after again, after I rinsed out the deep conditioner. Um, I followed up with the Curl Enhancement Smoothie. No, not really. I forgot something. After I rinsed out the deep conditioner, I followed up with my leave-in, which is the Giovanni Direct Leave-In. And I need some more. Then after that, I put the Direct Leave-In on my section. I followed up with the Curl Enhancement Smoothie and some... Castor oil. Now, the back ones, this is the first section that I did in the back, which they are still coiled. I don't have them to this side. I think I made them too big or whatever, but I'm still going to wear them because it still looks presentable and it still looks nice and fresh. It's a different look. Um, I coiled my hair about 10 months ago, and it was very short, um, very short. I had nothing hanging down. Everything was, like, coiling, going straight up. I have the video. I found the video on my phone, 
and I think I might post it. But um, yeah, I follow what's in that simply unique routine, and but she used the Miss Jessie's. I think it was baby buttercream, if I'm not mistaken, and. She didn't even have a lot of coils in her hair, but her hair still was the nice. Um, but I like it. It's something different. That's one thing. I like to do different things. But the next move I may make, I may do the, uh, the twist the size in my head and, like, pin them up. You know what I mean? Because I need a protective styling. Need a protective style in my hair. I haven't done one this whole winter, as you can say. But um, that's all I use. And when I watched the old video, I did the Kima Two leave-in and some cash oil, and the they were like very nice. So I'm gonna do another quick turnaround for y'all. I think they're pretty good. So yeah, nothing else is going on. Just taking it easy. I'm about to shower, get ready to go to bed. I need to be up by six o'clock. So I have approximately five hours to get some rest. You know. So um that's it guys. As far as the weight loss thing is happening, the scale is still there, but I can tell that I am losing the inches. My clothes are getting big, so that's always a plus. So don't don't you know, always pay attention to the scale. The scale is not always right. The scale can be your enemy. Um, anything else? No, that's it. Um, if you want to follow me on Instagram, my Instagram name is Love Is Me, L U V I Z N E E. And, you know, come check me out. Welcome to my world over there, also. Um, come follow me. I'll follow back. Um, what else? That's basically it. And don't forget to comment, rate, and subscribe. And always be true. And always be you. And this is me. Signing off. 10 4 over and out. And have a blessed week. I'll see you guys next weekend. Take care. Bye.